Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is Adam. This is HMO4Gaming. Welcome you back to Scarlet Nexus. In the last episode, one of our team members got turned into an other by a phantom bullet that was meant for someone else, for um, some Mare, some Mire, whoever the other protagonist is, I already forget. I'm just <laughs> I'm trying to remember Yurito's name. In this episode, we're chasing after the, the gunman that shot said gun in order to uh, see what's going on. And before we get started, please hit like, hit subscribe, do all those things on down below. Now let's continue on forward. Pretty cool architecture here. It literally looks like we're underneath like a reverse city almost. Like, like we're not even supposed to be here and there's like the oily like air that you see up there. It's kind of creepy. I'm just waiting for something to appear at me because, I mean, this can't be just a long highway of nothingness. Those guys were National Defense Forces. Where did they take Naomi? Why did she just change into another? There's a lot we don't understand, but it's a fact that Naomi is another now. <laughs> it's glad that you're taking this with a grain of salt. I mean, I could have used my powers to move all that, but eh. Oh, hello, Poppin. Now, it's been a while since I played this, so hopefully, uh... Alright, no, I'm still good. Alright, there we go. I almost forgot what the controls were. Alright, we still good. Alright. I think I upgraded my sword in between episodes, so it's a little bit, yeah, better at this point because I'm playing the game playing the game playing the game and I'm not really too sure if there's like a grinding that I would have to do for the most part I mean it doesn't really seem like there's side quests um, and then from what I've seen from different outlets that this isn't really that long of a game and boy does that look like a boss fight just two random people waiting for us or it could just be wrong it could just be our friends that somehow got in front of us but I doubt it hello Oh. Major General Karin? Oh, she did you run after her head. You two take care of her. I'm returning to the front line to regroup the units. Yes, sir. Kasane. Uh, where's Naomi? I suppose I can tell you, since you saw the whole thing. Oh, was she, she was I know taken it? by troops stationed in Ceyron. So that car was from the Ceyron garrison? Yes, so? Something's not right. When I reported this to Major General Fubuki, he told me not to tell anyone else, and to tell you to do the same. Major General Karin said the same thing. Why tell us to keep quiet? Does that mean OSF is hiding something? I don't know. Major General Fubuki said it would protect us. And take a look at this. It seems like the Ceyron garrison dropped this, too. Yeah, it's conspiracy. I remember seeing this at home when I was a child. According to the major chief, you just remember seeing drug like drug that bullets. Boosts powers. He wanted me to turn them over, but I managed to keep two of them without him. She remember seeing that drugs in her house. Uh oh. In any case, why would something like that be at my home? Uh, your parents might be druggies, Kasane. I'm sorry. Anything related to drug manufacturing would have only been joint ventures with Spring Pharmaceuticals. He also mentioned that this drug was classified information. It seems like the top brass of the OSF know about it. Spring Pharmaceuticals is Major General Fubuki's family company. Perhaps the commander knew because of that. Don't trust new Himuka. What? What is that supposed to mean? It's something Karin said. I'm not exactly sure what he meant by it either. If this ampule really is from Ceyron, then does that mean the Randalls and Springs are cooperating with Ceyron? Even if that's the case, it just leaves us with more questions. It might be best to do as we were told. We keep this to ourselves and look into it privately. That ampule seems to be pretty important. Might be a good idea to hide it. Then I'll hide the ampule inside Baki. Huh? huh? I didn't think you'd know how to sew. I was always told to be independent, ever since I was little. Done. There's two, so who's going to hold on to them? Oh, Gee, pass. maybe the two protagonists? I think you two should <laughs> probably carry them. Baki. 
Oh, I just realized My you can look around so happy. in each little cutscene. That's cool. About Naomi. I'm sorry. I knew that other was Naomi, but I was scared. I... I had no other choice but to fight. Hmm. Stop it. I'll get Naomi back. Just don't get in my way. This might come off as naive, but I want to do what I can to help save her, too. It is naive, but thank you. Oh, nice one, Sugumi. Looks like everyone's here. Huh, where's Naomi? Isn't she with you? Weren't you guys with us? What's wrong? I'll tell you later. Uh, where's Nagi? And Captain Seto and Hanabi. Nagi is with the rescue team on the front line. Captain and Hanabi are totally fine. They're worried about you, so we should get out of here. No, the rest of you go first. She didn't supposed to be up ahead, so I'll pick him up. Then I'll go with you. For better or worse, I'm the leader of Kyoko Platoon until this mission is over. All right. Be careful. So I guess it's best we join up with Captain Seto and head over to the hideout. So, this is your family's unit. It's a good fit geographically, and is well equipped. I hope we can use it as a hideout. You don't mind? Of course not. It doesn't look like it's being used by my family anymore. Then we'll use this as our platoon's hideout. I'm just glad you're okay. We were all really worried. Sugumi was crying her eyes out. I was not. What? Sugumi, you've got the hots for Yuito? What about me? <laughs> Shut up. Harsh. Where's Naomi? Did she and Gemma regroup with Kyoka Platoon? Oh, uh... Naomi is... Uh, it's not like Naomi is dead. But I can't just say she turned into another. And... Other... Got her. And that's your plan? <gasps> no way. Naomi? But she's the best next to Kasane. She's so nice. That's why you look so down. That must have been hard, losing a friend like that. Everyone goes through that at least once. I won't tell you to cheer up, but this is something you're going to have to learn to accept. To survive in the OSF, it's necessary. I understand. Let's rest here a while. You have my permission. Take some time to get yourself together. It's a sad situation, but the others won't wait. Alright, you can get gifts to allies and honor. You can mainly get gifts from shops and exchange. Bonds will strengthen, or if you give something you like. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I already figured that. Masabi has been added to the world map. Did Major General Fubuki ask you to be quiet about Naomi? Yeah, he did. He told me to say the same thing to Kasane. Did he tell you too? Yeah. I don't like not telling the truth. Well, she has a little link thing right now, so let's do that sorry, real quick. Yuido. It's too bad about Naomi, but you did the best you could. <laughs> Rest Who's she talking to? Yes, sir. Oh, well, I thought that was me. Hello? Oh, the relief team said they'd taken that. Good work, Yuito. Sorry I couldn't support you the whole time. It's fine. There was nothing you could do. Anyway, Naomi... This whole in-the-head stuff is kind of weird. Yeah, I heard. She was so nice. Oh, this dude's not even in our room. Alright, I'd like to do this Bond episode. Everyone just keeps talking. Can we talk? Huh? Talk? Sure. Oh, are you busy? It's okay if you are. N no, it's fine. I just wasn't ready. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. I'm sorry for showing up so suddenly. But, I'm sorry. Don't apologize, really. I'm not good at chatting. I just can't think of what to say, and I get all quiet. I feel like people get uncomfortable when they talk to me, so I always apologize. I don't feel uncomfortable at all, so don't worry about it. Talk as slowly as you need to. Thanks. 
So, did you want something? Oh, it's not that important, but I saw you watering the flowers at OSF headquarters before. I wanted to ask you if you like flowers and plants. Yeah, gardening is my hobby. I've grown lots of plants since I was little. Wow, gardening sounds fun. There were a lot of plants in my garden at home, too. Your garden is probably big. Yeah, I bet taking care of it was hard. We've kind of let it go lately. That's too bad. It is. There were all kinds of flowers before. I used to enjoy spending time looking at them. Oh, Yuito, you like plants? Huh? Well, I suppose you could say I do. I've never actually grown them myself, though. What kind do you like? Flowers or decorative shrubs? Big trees are cool, too. Hmm. Well, if I had to choose... Oh, right. There were these beautiful white flowers in our garden. I liked those. They seem kind somehow. They only bloom for a short time, though. Do you know the flower's name? No, I don't. The old gardener who planted them quit a long time ago. Hmm. Sugumi? Why are you so quiet? I think I can find that flower. What? You can do that? Mm-hmm. I'm good at investigating plants. It will be faster if I have more information. Information? Oh, you mean like the flower's characteristics? Um... I think it bloomed in the winter. Mm-hmm. What else? Tell me exactly what it looks like. The petals are small and kind of pointed, and the tips of them are tinged pink. The leaves were oval, long, and thin, and kind of came up around the bottom. It was about this big. Does that make sense? I get the idea. Now, do you remember the number of petals? That's a small detail. So you might not. Yeah. I'm not so sure, but I think it was about six? No, wait. Maybe seven. Yeah, it was seven. I think. You have a good memory. That's plenty of information. I'll look into it. I'll let you know when I know the name. Thanks. I'd be so happy if I could see that flower again. Hey, Sugumi? No, this is lanceolate. Smaller and cyclic. It doesn't look like she can hear me. I guess she really does like plants. Mm. She's really focused. I'll leave her alone. Alright, well, that wasn't really much of a mission. <laughs> uh, rest on the sofa ends the standby phase. Okay. Anyone messaging me? I keep pressing up, but it keeps telling me, no, we can't. Garrison, got a minute. I want to talk to you in person, so you come to Mishubi. Plans that we'll begin the Bond episode reply. Yeah, sure. Is there a message from you, Ashashi? I'll head there right now. Yeah, might as well. I mean, I did the flowers. Might as well see what this Bond episode's about. The floor is a hologram. Basically seems like you're in water. Cool. Um, it should be a place where you meet people. Okay. What is it? I find it hard to believe you need to talk to me about something. First, I want you to look at this. The menu? Okay. New menu festival. Finish our large portions within the time limit and your meal is free. Also receive a bonus case of soda. Wait. You're not asking me to do this, are you? I sure am. You eat, and I get the soda prize. <laughs> Don't worry, if you can't finish it all, I'll pay for the meal. This is what you wanted to talk about? This is about? the kind of stuff you throw in your Japanese oh, RPG no, in the middle of <laughs> main story it's missions. It's a new menu, so the food is about three times more than usual. A kid your age should have a pretty big appetite. You can totally do it. Look, it says you need a reservation. I don't think... Don't worry, I already made one. You planned everything already. I guess I'd feel bad canceling on them now. Okay, I'll try. Oh, I'm so full. 
God. Good job. That was a lot of food. You didn't let me down. Still, I may have pushed you too hard. Next time, I'll get you whatever food you like to make it up to you. No. No more food. I know. Can you come adjust SAS with me now? You want me to adjust your SAS? What? Why? What? I heard you're really good at that stuff. Oh, boy. Hmm. Without context? I mean, I boy. I force you or anything. Something was just feeling off about it. Okay, fine. I guess I owe you for helping me get what I want. You mean the soda? You must really love soda. So much that I can't refuse your request. Let's get this over with already. Sorry for asking you to do this. It's fine. You're a lot more impatient than I thought, though. I don't see why we couldn't do the SAS adjustments later. This was a good opportunity to get you to look at it. And I wanted to get it done as soon as possible. I don't want to run into issues with the SAS during battle. I don't like causing problems for everyone. Shouldn't you be more concerned with your own survival? Peach posh. It almost sounds like you don't prioritize your own life. I guess you could say that. You weren't even aware of it? Great. Another one destined for an early death. You should be letting loose a little more. Or not to slack off a little. Slack off? No, I couldn't. It's important to know when you can ease up. Taking proper breaks will increase your overall productivity. In other words, skipping out on work is the rational recommendation. What happens if the others attack when you're easing up? And someone gets hurt. Oh, you're so serious. Is it any fun to live like that? I can't help it. That's just the way I am. I know someone just like you. I feel so sorry for you both. Who else is like me? Okay, we're done. The RSG Support Center is closed for the day. Please contact us again during our regular business hours. Huh? That was quick. Thanks. Now we're even for today. That means I can enjoy my soda guilt-free. Also, don't work too hard. See ya. She's different. All right. What other kind of brain missions I got? Cola is the best after hard day's work. You should take a break sometime. Just hearing a cola reminds me of the contest. I feel so full, but I'm glad to help. This may sound weird coming from me, but you too. Be soft. Be careful enough to get tripped up. Anybody else have a bond mission anywhere? While we uh, got time in between episodes? Doesn't seem like it. Feeling happy listening to the talk. Naomi, that was difficult. Quit gift. I ain't got no gifts. Oh, she's back on the couch now. Anybody in the kitchen? No. So I don't think I can really do anything else. So I might as well just sit on the sofa and progress to the next phase. Yep. I'm tired. Maybe I should rest a bit. I mean, I talked to everyone, did both missions, Flower Girl and Soda Girl. So we can now progress. Huh? Where's Captain Seto? He was literally we sitting right to next to us when we while. sat down on this couch. He said he's going back to work, but we can do whatever we want until we're needed. Sorry, but that's the end of free time. Seto platoon is being called. My, my. The boss says it's time to work. Yuito, Hanabi, you ready? Yeah. I'm okay, too. I guess I have to be. Yeah, as long as you're OSF, you'll lose people like this. You have to get over it. You're right. Phase three, inside up down reality. Is the OSF hiding something? Fall is summoned, Yoda returns. Nagi! When were you discharged? I would have come to get you. Huh? Oh, they suddenly said I could leave this morning. Oh man, so you were called in as soon as you were discharged? That's bad luck. You were in the hospital since the mission in the abandoned subway. Are you all healed? You know it. I was getting rusty, so I was glad for the deployment. Sorry to keep everyone waiting. What's this? So you're back, Nagi. Hey, don't push yourself too hard. I won't. <sighs> all right then. 
These orders are from Major General Karin. Others are reported along the Kunad Highway. We'll move in three-man teams again. Team one is Nagi, Sugumi, and myself. Team two is Kagero, Yuito, and Hanabi. Lately, a lot of national defense forces are deployed along the Kunad Highway. It's an army, but they're still normal people. We can't let them get involved in a fight with others. If you happen to see them, tell them to keep their distance from the area. Let's head out to Kunad Highway. Nagi, are you okay? Hmm? If you mean my wounds, I'm fine. Not that. I mean about Naomi. Oh, I mean, I was shocked that Naomi died in battle, but I can't let that affect me forever. What? Died in battle? Naomi is alive. Huh? That's not funny. Huh? Oh, um, I guess it is kind of weird to refer to her as alive when she exists as another. But she's definitely alive, and we might be able to change her back. She's another. Are you feeling okay? Huh? We're deploying, so stop the crazy talk. We have to fight others for new Himuka. We have to accept that Naomi is dead and move on. Come on, let's go. What's wrong with Nagi? What the hell they do to him in that hospital? Kanad Highway has been added to the world map. Brain Hospital. I pressed RB and up. Thank you. Now the hospital. Oh, I can't really respond. Everyone's saying, yay, welcome back from the hospital that you may or may not have gotten some interesting treatment from. So I think in the next episode, we will be starting the next mission. Sorry that this episode was basically just doing a bunch of bomb missions in the intermission, but I had no idea that the intermission was going to start. So in the next episode, we'll be starting our next mission on the Kunad Highway, and I hope you join me for that. But until next time, I have been Adam, this has been HMO4 Gaming, and this has been Scarlet Nexus, here on the Xbox Series X. Thank you very much. Have yourselves a great day.